Okay, hello everyone. Uh, we're going to talk about what are data structures and algorithms and this course is for beginners. Uh, first of all, let's talk about what are data structures. So data structures are a way to store and organize data so that it can be used efficiently. And um, uh, data structure isn't a programming language like C, C++, Java, etc. So it's actually a set of algorithm that can be used in any programming language to organize the data in the memory. So you can use it with Java, you can use it with C programming, you can use it with Python. Uh, in this tutorial, we are going to talk about using it with C programming. So now we understand what data structures are. They are a way to store and organize data. Let's also talk about what is an algorithm. So algorithm is nothing but uh, certain steps you take to perform a task. So they're just set of instructions uh, that you use to complete a task. They are the building blocks of programming and they allow things like computers, smartphones and websites to function and make decisions. So it could be as simple as preparing tea. Uh, if you want to prepare tea, then there are certain steps that you take. For example, you pour hot water uh, into the kettle. Uh, you put sugar, you mix sugar in that and then you put milk and you mix that. So there are like three or four steps that we take when we prepare tea and that is nothing but an algorithm. Of course, uh, computers are a lot smarter and um, if you give them a set of instructions, they execute it really, really well. So now that we understand what data structures are and what is an algorithm, let's understand why do we actually need to study the data structures? What is the reason why we need to talk about it? So first is that as the applications are becoming more and more complex, there's definitely the problem of the processing speed, searching data, handling multiple requests. And uh, when we are dealing with large applications, the data could be like really, really complex. So at that point of time, uh, the processing speed does matter. Uh, how much time it takes to search the data. All of those things are important. Now, data structures provide a way of organizing, managing and storing this data efficiently. With the help of data structures, data items can be traversed easily. So let's say you have a list, an array, uh, you can traverse through it very easily once you study the data structure. And um, it really provides you with the efficiency, reusability, and of course, the abstraction. So especially for programmers, there are two most important things in computer science. One is data structure and second is algorithm. So learning data structures will definitely make you a better programmer because then you can outweigh two different ways of solving the same problem because one problem can be solved in different ways. So you have to find out the most efficient way to solve that problem. And that is where learning data structures and algorithms will help you because uh, you will be able to outweigh which one is the best solution for a problem. And you will be able to write code that is more efficient and more reliable.